Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome, my name is Claire. I've got an unboxing to share with you and it's the latest limited edition, the Trend in Beauty edit from Beauty Bay. It costs £40 and it has a value of £148 and it contains 19 skincare products. Now this unfortunately is sold out. It's sold out really, really quickly. And I'm not surprised because the products inside are really, really good. I haven't opened it up yet, but I wanted to do a little video. Although you can't buy it yourself, if you do decide to carry on watching, it'll give you an idea of the type of boxes that Beauty Bay do bring out and if you follow me on Instagram, Facebook or even on my community page on YouTube as soon as I spot that they're going to be releasing a new beauty box then I will post up everywhere so that you can sign up to get notified of when new boxes are released. They are known to go pretty quickly especially when it's a mixed brand beauty box. I'll pop a link to Beauty Bay down in my description and if I can find there might be like a sign up page that you might be able to sign up so if I can find that for the next one then although I don't know when the next one will be or what it will be but they usually bring them out every other month or so or something like that but yeah you'll find all the details down below in my description as well as all my discount codes and offers to other websites so you're welcome to take a look if you want to so let's go on to show me then what's inside i'm feeling a little bit sicky i have just filmed me trying eight icelandic chocolate bars so that video will be going up by the Friday or Sunday night. I just come back from Iceland. I love trying chocolates and sweets whenever I'm in different countries. So I thought this time I'd do a video about it. So yes, yeah, so I feel a little bit sicky. I could do with something savoury now. But obviously there's nothing in this box. But there's a sneak peek of what's inside. Right, I'll just grab anything. There's no information about the products, but all the products that you see in this video, you can go onto the Beauty Bay website and you'll be able to purchase them individually. So we've got Florence by Mills. This is a surfing under the eyes, hydrating and dry treatment gel pads. There's one use pads there. I don't think I've tried these. Next we've got a cleansing balm by Beauty Bay's own brand and it's called by Beauty Bay and this is chamomile and oat lipid cleansing balm. It works to deeply cleanse and moisturise, use morning and night and there's 90 mils there. Offers soothing properties as part of a complex to help calm stressed and inflamed skin. That was chamomile. And then oat lipid rich and ceramides to replenish the skin while cleansing. Oh, you got a little spatula. Love that. That's the balm. Oh, it's got a very subtle smell. So you've got chamomile and oat lipid cleansing balm. I love this product. I love it. It's Thigh Rescue by Mega Babe. It stops chafe. Anti-friction stick. There's 23 grams here. This is a little mini. You can get it at this size and you can get it bigger sizes as well. My thighs meet in the middle when I walk. In the summertime I wear a lot of dresses so these chafing sticks are amazing they're bombs they are like a deodorant you know like a deodorant stick but it's brilliant pop it in your handbag you don't need to do it that often I just do it maybe once or twice a day that was it and um, no soreness whatsoever but you can also use it for armpits well anywhere anywhere where you get a bit of rubbing a bra strap underneath your boobs your belly and anywhere anywhere but yeah I definitely recommend it if you've never tried one before next we've got Brazilian Crush Serosa this is a fragrance spray by Sol de Janeiro 30 mils love this iconic smell when I was in the oh Bristol airport <laughs> I think it was in Iceland coming back into Bristol I think so I saw a massive bottle of this which I've never seen before you know huge huge bottle <laughs> So I grabbed it and sprayed myself. <laughs> it's just a classic summer scent. I just think of summer whenever I smell it. Next, we've got Slam Dunk Hydrating Moisturiser by Bubble. And this is 10 mils there. Love the packaging. I thought it might be a lip balm to start with, but no. It's a moisturiser. Oh, it feels nice. Yeah. This one. No, no scent. That feels really, really nice, actually. If you've tried Bubble Moisturiser, let me know what you think about it. Then we've got Isoclean. And this is something I've never had before. It's a cosmetic sponge cleaner. There's 110 mils here. I've received in boxes and bought as well the spray to clean brushes. And I love it. It is such a great product. So I use makeup sponges all the time. So yeah, I'll definitely give that a go. Then we've got Minimalist. This is retinol 0.6% face serum with rosehip oil, coenzyme Q10 and squalene. All those ingredients sound really great together. Visibly reduces wrinkles for all skin types. 
and there's 30 mils there. Oh my word, it's like, it's like parcel parcel. I got another box <laughs> that it's in. So to use at night, start with one to two times per week and increase gradually. But yeah, I haven't heard of this brand, Minimalist. It works best with Alpha Arbutin 0.2% serum to visibly reduce dark spots and Ceramides 0.3% cream to fortify the moisture barrier. I like the sound of that. Again, this is why I love the Beauty Bay boxes because it introduces me to new brands. Then I got a Spectrum brush. I love Spectrum. This is Rose Quartz Tapered Finish Brush, a A04. It's like in the box there. I've got a tool. I treated myself to a tool. Look. Oh, a little blade. So no more damaging nails, ripping the heck out of packaging. <laughs> nope, I've got that and I'm going to keep it on the windowsill so I never lose it. This is so nice, look. Big fluffy brush. Yeah, I really like that. That would be a really nice brush for my... I've got an hourglass palette of three ambient lighting diffused um, face powders and they're really nice. That would be perfect. After I've done my bronzer and blush, then I go over then with my ambulant, 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 ambient powders. Just like there, just to give a nice glow to finish off my face and there that's pivot size <laughs> then i got doll beauty she's fine liner in shade run the world so it's a pencil but what's the color oh that is nice color it's like a latte like a taupey brownie shade yeah that's a little bit different i like that it's got a liner then we got tokobo Again, a new brand. This is a bio watery sun cream, SPF 50, and there's 10 mils here. And I'm guessing it's Korean. They do the most amazing SPFs. I love, thank you, Pharma. They are so, so good. I love the fact that it's SPF 50. Oh, we got another one. This is Beauty of Joseon, Relief Sun, Rice and Probiotics, and there's a factor 50 plus in there as well. I've had the full size version of this in a Korean advent calendar called Stylevana a couple of years ago and it's so nice especially good for your skin if you suffer from redness like what I do yeah it's a really nice brand so you yeah, happy with that Peter Thomas Ruff and this is instant eye firm temporary eye tightener instantly tightens and firms the look of under eye puffiness there's five mils here I had this in a beauty box a couple of months ago and I put it to the side and I was gonna try it on myself and my husband to see what it would be like, and I can't find it. It's somewhere in my little hallway room where I keep all my beauty stuff, but I can't find it anywhere. But I've seen videos of people using it, and it's like that instant firming sort of creams that you see now and again that if you put makeup on, it looks horrific. <laughs> they temporarily get rid of your wrinkles. Yeah, so I've yet to use it, but it's an eye tightener. I'm gonna have to put that somewhere safe to definitely try it, because I'm curious. Then we've got B by Beauty Bay, their own brand. This is a liquid cream blush in shade Peaches. Oh, I love this little tool. So it's a big whopper of a blush. Oh, look at the colour. That is really pretty. Oh, Let's see how it blends. That is gorgeous though. I've put too much on. Clearly. Let's see how it blends out there, look. I do love a coral blush. Yeah, see, that's quite nice. Ignore that part when it's blended out I think that's a really nice colour obviously you can have it as intense as you like but yeah I really like that it's a moussey type formula which is nice so there's that then I got B by Beauty Bay their own brand this is volume mascara high key yeah I'm really fussy with my mascaras I'll definitely give that a go I love trying new ones and I don't think I've tried that one before sometimes Beauty Bay do their own brand mystery boxes which are really great value for money I've tried the eye shadows and I've tried some of their skincare and they are really really good so if you're interested in trying some of their own branded items then look out for when they do release mystery boxes they do them every couple of months or so that might be a good way of like introducing you to the brand well, we've got here Glow Hub this is facial serum the scar slayer I love the sound of that tranexamic acid and vitamin c for scarring dark spots and dark spots and pigmentation yep that is me <laughs> oh i'm noticing the older i'm getting 
the spots that I'm getting on my chin in particular, they're just taking forever to heal and disappear. So no, this sounds really great. It sounds right up my street. We've got Inky List. This is a clear lip balm. This is Tripeptide Plumping Lip Balm. I don't think I've had a lip balm from Inky List before. I don't think so anyway. But I like the sound of it. No, it sounds really good. I've got a load of lip balms all collected together for us all to use in the house. <laughs> then we got Super Goop. This is Glow Screen. This is SPF 30 Hydrating Glowing Sunscreen Primer. I love Super Goop, but this is a little bit too glowy for me. It's just a little bit too glowy. Yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> so I'll be passing that on. Then we've got a little stick. This is a nude sticks matte all over face blush and colour in shade Picante. So you can use that as a blush or as a lipstick. I think I've received this before in one of their boxes. There. It's not my favourite to be honest. I do like nude sticks. It's just the shade is just too orange for me for a lipstick and a blush. But um, but yeah, the formula is really nice though and it does blend nicely. But I'll be passing that on. And then lastly, we have got Clean Skin Club Redefining Clean Clean Towels Extra Large 10 bio Base Facial Towels. I received this in their last beauty box. I think it's the last one or the one before. I'll just get one out and show you. They are disposable facial towels made of ultra soft premium viscose that is Ocotex and USDA BioBase certified. They were created to be a hygienic alternative to regular face towels and an all round staple in your beauty routine and home. Once you try them, you'll never want to go back to using your washcloth. If it's great if you're away from home, if you're on holidays, stay in the way somewhere for the weekend, but they're biodegradable, which is good. And they're lovely. They're really nice cloths. <laughs> nice and soft as well. And strong. But then my washcloths are great because I just wash them in the washing machine. <laughs> and then I dry them and then I use them again. So I'm a bit baffled why I'd want this in my home. Great for going away, as I said, but at home, makeup removing cloths then. You know, the microfiber cloths. That's what I use. But yeah. Would you feel the same as me? I'd love to hear. And there you go. Those are all the 19 products inside the Trending Beauty Edit from Beauty Bay. That sold out pretty quickly. Did you buy it? What do you think of the products? Are you going to look out for their next beauty box? Or are you thinking, nah, it's just not worth £40, Claire? I'd love to hear. So please comment down below and I'll see you in my next video. It might be my microblading eyebrows video or it might be me eating a load of Icelandic chocolate video. <laughs> I'll see how it goes. Take care. Bye.